Okay, so now that we've discussed the basics of a firewall, it's a perfect time to discuss the exact opposite of a firewall, which is a DMZ or demilitarized zone. Basically, what a DMZ is is a computer or group of computers which you choose to have no firewall protection at all. You're basically saying, I want these computers to be outside the firewall for whatever reason. Now this can become necessary if you have a game or some sort of application where no amount of port forwarding will allow it to function properly. Sometimes it's just easier to put something on the DMZ. Of course it's a security risk, but it may be a security risk you're willing to take. That decision is totally up to you. Another good use for a DMZ is to use it as a troubleshooting tool. If we're trying to figure out why a certain application we're trying to use on the internet does not function, and we place that application on the DMZ and all of a sudden it functions flawlessly, well then we know that the problem is something to do with the way the firewall is configured. From that point, we can focus all our efforts on getting the firewall set up properly. Okay, well that basically concludes our discussion on networking terms you need to know to understand how to configure a router's web interface. I hope it's been both interesting and informative for you.